For the following exercise, determine if the given graph is a one-to-one -one function. All right, so you definitely just want to understand what a one-to-one -one function is, and I have a basic definition down here, that a one-to-one -one function is a function where each x can have only one y. Now that should sound familiar, okay? That part is actually the definition of a function, okay? Where each x can have only one y. So that's a function at a minimum, okay, function. And then the second part is now where each y can have only one x. Now that is the one-to-one -one part. Okay, one, two, one. So in order to find out whether this particular graph represents a one-to-one -one function, the first thing is we have to make sure it's a function in general. Okay, and that would mean doing the vertical line test. And then, if it is a function, then we can check whether it's a one-to-one -one function or not by doing the horizontal line test. All right, the horizontal line test is basically the same thing as the vertical line test, just, you know, horizontal. <laughs> so now, if I were to see if this thing is even a function in general, I would draw a vertical line down the graph and see if it intersects in two or more places. And it does, right? It intersects in two or more places, and that violates the definition of a function, right? Because the x value of negative 2 has two corresponding y values. That's a no-no for a function. So this is not a function. Not a function. And if it isn't a function, how could it possibly a one-to-one -one function? It's impossible because it's not even a function overall. That's it. Guys, thanks for tuning in. Please remember to subscribe. See you in the next problem.